Yeah, right, guys, it's Game Boy Luke, and welcome back to some more Pokemon X. In the previous episode, we got the almighty Charmander. Yes, Charmander! And he's got a super cool nature. I'm really, really happy with that nature. Uh, and Conker also evolved into Quilladin. Hopefully, we'll have a couple more evolutions uh, during this episode. Uh, people are actually telling me to get rid of Infahawk here because uh, he sees he seem as kind of a redundant type, as Charmander is. Um, a fire fly it's going to be a fire flying type and obviously and Fletchling will evolve eventually into a fire flying type. Now I don't particularly know what I'm gonna do, but for now I guess I'll keep him on my team uh, until other people really give me uh, suggestions. But if um, everyone every else agrees with this, then I'll get rid of him. Uh, but for the time being, he's he's cool where he is because I mean even if um, I do keep him on my team. Uh, he he's going to be a fire flying type, but Charmander will evolve. Is going to is going to be um, Charizard X, which is dragon and fire. So they're kind of different types. Uh, Charizard X isn't affected by water type moves because of the dragon typing. So yeah, it's all it all depends what people 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 want anyway, and what you guys want. Okay, so this Kadabra is level 13. This guy is a hacker because Abra doesn't evolve to level 16, and it's impossible to have confusion. Because Kadabra doesn't learn that to level 16. So, Kadabra, stop being a pro Haxor. And I'm trying to run away from a battle when I can't do that. Uh, let's go to Conquer. Nope. Yeah, let's go Conquer. Even though I think this is going to actually suicide him. but Because one conf you can take one confusion. I don't know how that's taking... Oh no, he's going to use Kinesis. Whoa, man. Bending spoons with your mind. It's so pro source. Okay, let's just go with the bike because that's super effective. He's going to use Kinesis twice, we're just going to have our accuracy. I think that really halves it. Oh no, we're still going to hit though. So you don't give a fuck. Kapow. He's going to give us some bear experience right there. It's our gone go to level 14. It's great stuff. And Info Hulk's going to level. Frickin' hell. So many level ups! Experience share OP. Okay, so let's. Ooh. Info Hulk's evolving! It evolves level 17. How weird is that? That's a really random. Level to evolve, so go, 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 go. Oh my god, awesome! Fire type evolving takes so long <laughs> in this game. <laughs> it's evolved into that's a cool cry. Fletchender, awesome. He looks kind of cool, actually. I like this Pokemon. What's the an Ember? Sweet, uh, let's get rid of. Uh, flail, we're not going to need to use that. Okay, so even though we've got the adamant nature and our special attack is reduced, I'm sure we're going to learn some physical fire moves at some point. Hopefully. I'm, I'm guessing we're going to learn flare blitz or something soon. Alright, so let's use this grime rail and head down here. And pick up this item, which is a soup potion. Totally worth it. Totally worth it. Alright, let's just have to skip around in this park again because you know how awesome we are. In the box. Alright. Head back up here, traipse through the grass and encounter a Pokemon. And it is a Skidoo. I suppose we could try and take this guy out because why not? Why not? We should probably heal up actually because Charmander is taking bare hits right now. Okay. Yeah, I'll take 32 HP. That's awesome. Skidoo, stop tackling me, bro. Alright, Charmander, use Ember. Obviously, uh, the um, the um, ad the adamant nature isn't too helpful as of now because Charmander is a uh, has his attack uh, raised and his special attack reduced, so it's kind of a sucky nature right now. But you know, also the other, another reason why I want to keep Infahawk on my team is because I want to use him for fly and Charizard. I don't want to give Charizard X fly because uh, I, I think he can have some pretty cool moves. I think. A uh, fly would be a waste. I'm gonna move, so. What's down here? Grind rail. What's a berry? Orange berry. Okay, all that way. Can we go back up this thing? Is that even possible? No, it's not. Okay, so we gotta go back round. Through this grass. Probably encounter a Pokemon. Nope, okay. Up this hill. Alright. So where are we now? Oh, there's some chick. Practicing her roller skating skills like our boss. Nah, no, kidding. Let's just let's just take this chick out. 
Uh, hopefully, Charmander should evolve real soon as well, so that's two evolutions, or three evolutions in the space of two episodes, which is awesome. Alright. Sup, Bunnelby? Uh, I'm thinking maybe it's use Scratch, because our physical attack's actually better than our special. But then again, Ember does get the almighty stab boost, so let's see, let's see what that does. Let's see how much this, this Ember does compared to Tackle. No, it does more, okay. Oh no, we got a crit there, that doesn't, that's not, that's not fair judgement. Alright, who's next? Skiddo! We can take you out, we just practiced against you. Okay, so I was thinking, um... I'm actually really enjoying playing this game, and I don't want to lose that enjoyability. So, what I'm going to do is... In between episodes, I'm actually going to catch Pokemon as well. I'll probably go back to the first route, and I'm going to catch Pokemon. So, if my Pokemon are more leveled up then you know why, because you actually get experience for capturing Pokemon in this game. So what I'm going to do is I'll make my best effort to actually capture all of the Kalos po region Pokemon. But I probably won't do most of it on screen. I don't, I honestly, uh, I don't really know what my plan is, but... Because it, it takes a long time to capture Pokemon on screen, but... And a lot of effort, so... Well, I'll probably do... What the fuck? Dude, battle me. Because uh, I, I, I don't want to just rush through this playthrough. I want to take my time. It's what they called Saver in the game. Hey, doo doo. Doo 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 doo. Alright, Charmander is level 15 now, so we are so close to being the awesome Charmeleon and getting that Fire Fang soon. Scratch is not going to do much damage at all. Doo doo looks pretty cool in this, actually. And their models highly resemble. Oh, wow, you got a crit, you cheeky little sh. That's it, mate, I'm going to wreck you. Let's test out Inferhawk. Let's see how badass this guy is. Oh wow, he's smaller than I thought he was. He's smaller than Pidgeotto. Let's see how much Ember does. Oh, well, our special attack is reduced, so I don't really, uh... don't expect it to do much. Peck won't do much to us either, but... May as well just finish this thing off with a quick attack. There we go. That's right, Doduo. That's what I thought. Awesome. You followed the rules perfectly! Yeah, of course. I don't cheat. That's not my, that's not my kind of thing. Alright, uh, actually, instead of going across this grass, we're going to grind this rail. But we're not going fast enough. So you have to come around here. And then what we do is, if you stand here and dash... Yeah, there we go. And we have another one here as well, so... Whoa! TM! TM, TM, TM. What's this? Hone Claws! Ooh, that sounds like a perfect move to give Charmander, actually. Because of his physicalness. Boosts attack and accuracy, and Fire Fang actually has reduced accuracy. Uh, it's like 95%, so if you use Home Claws, then it means that Fire Fang is going to be 100% hit ratio. So let's uh, remove Growl and teach Home Claws. Awesome, I'm actually happy with that. That's a cool move. Okay, so I'm gonna actually going to level up uh, Fletchinder here and stick him in first position, get him to level 20. Alrighty then, let's, uh, well, where, we, where can we go now? Over here? Didn't we battle you? Oh, no, we haven't battled you yet, okay. Fight me, bro! Okay, you're challenged by Rising Star Tyson. Hey, Tyson, how's it going? Uh, B, Baidoof, Baidoof, Baidoof. Let's take you down with a tackle. So I didn't realise tackle was actually stronger than quick attack in this game. Oh, shit, he's using defense curl. Oh snap, let's use Ember. Okay, go, 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 go. So, uh, I actually, I think I, think I, I think I already mentioned this, but yeah, like I said, I did catch a shiny Drudigan the other day. And I'm adding it to my collection, I'm hunting down shiny Pokemon now, I'm so, so hyped. <laughs> but yeah, alright, 17, Oddish, this is easy pickings for us. Oddish has a weird... Wow, Oddish's leaves have, like, tips on them now. What the hell? I've never noticed that before. Wow, Ember's crap on this thing. That's no special attack for us. Okay, let's use Quick Attack. pa 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 pow Easy. Easy! We are going to have a pretty bad weakness to flying with uh, Chestnut's weakness, so we're going to have to get an electric Pokemon at some point. I guess I have someone in mind. Oh, there's an item there, I want that item. Let's 
Let's run through here. Pink grass! Oh my god! What do we find in here? Fur baby? Fur fur. Fur fur fru. What a weird name, fur fru. I'm gonna run away from you. And that rhymed. Ha! <laughs> I'm hilarious. Okay. Shit. Wow, that was so totally worth it. X attacks all day. Alright, is there anything else around here? No. Okay. Alright, let's get back on our blades and challenge this this guy right here. Hey, bro. You're like a seasoned traveler. I bet you're good at battling too. Yeah. I'm a. I'm a. I'm a. I'm a what even is it? I can't remember what the word is. Uh, and I'm a an, an intermediate. I'm pro, no intermediate. All right, Centra. Look at you. It's just, <laughs> Centra looks so fat in this. It's, is it just me? It, it just looks like she looks so chubby. And it doesn't look impressed with my comments. I am very sorry, Centra, but truth be told. All right, that's you taken care of. Level 18, fuck yeah. Alright, awesome. Sweet! Let's just pass you real quick. And... Get... No, I want to stay on my rollerblades because they're fun. Oh, there's a kid here. Hey, bro! Is this the kid? Hi! Want to know why I always wear shorts when I walk through the tall grass? Well, yes I would, youngster. I guess we'll find out the answer after I kick this guy's ass. Alright. It's a pan sage. Pan sage is easy pickings for infrahawk. That peck though. Super effective. One hit KO. Bam. See you later. 162 experience. Because they're comfy and easy to wear. Oh, youngster. I totally remember you saying that back in Fire Red and stuff. Alright, so there's actual trees here. I suppose I should have got cut, but I don't know where a cut is. I probably skipped it, knowing me. I'm useless. Alright, so we're in the next town here. Camp Priya Town. Who's holo clipping us? Thank you for using holo oh, Thank you for using the holo caster. Lysandra Labs developed the holo caster to make the lives of Pokemon trainers richer, fuller, and more convenient. We hope you'll continue to enjoy the fine services this device provides. Okay, that was really random. Let's just ignore that shit. Hey, old man. It's about our time again, huh? The lat lazy lug will be back soon. Spoiler alert. Okay, what do we have in here? Whoa, hey. Yo, how's it going? I'm Cassius. Check this out. You know what I'm doing here? I'm keeping the P PC box running. No, seriously. Bill over in Canada. See, Bill over in Canada asked me to come here and run things for real. Enough of the, with the introductions. Get out of here. Catch the Pokemon and put them in the PC. Yo, you got anything you want to ask me? I ain't got all day, you know. Uh, trays. Trays are totally awesome, dude. They let, they let you select a bunch of Pokemon at, at a time and move them around the PC box. Oh, I didn't know that. That's actually pretty cool. Nothing, bro. Take this, thief. I ain't no thief. I ain't no thief, what you talking about? It's the items. Okay then. Now that's done with, I suppose we can go heal ourselves oh, ourselves up. Okay. Hey Nurse Joy, heal me up, bruh. Bruh, 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 bruh. Okay, that's awesome. Alright. Hey there. I was shocked when the weather changed during a Pokemon battle. Oh my god, crazy. Uh, how many Pokeballs do I have? 22, don't need Great Balls. Although Great Balls are like one of my favorite Pokeballs, they look awesome. As, alongside the Luxury Balls, Luxury Balls are the best. I guess we can buy Repels now as well. Let's just buy a handful of those, so I don't really see us using them anytime soon. Hey there. Hello, hello, I'm the official name rater. Oh, okay. Did I nickname all my Pokemon? Infohawk, Lizard, on Conquer, yeah. At least I know what the name rater is now. I actually didn't know that. Our uh, red suits the hot trend. Yeah, I need to t I need to tone myself up in red. When I, when I find the next shop, uh, clothes place anyway. Camper town. Is this like one of the hotels? I'm pretty sure there's one of these in like every single town, and they all look the exact same. Since you came all the way to Camper Town, take this with you. Yay items! That I probably won't use, but full heal is kind of helpful, I guess. I really can't bother to go upstairs, so. Okay. I can't go that way. Uh, what's down here? Is there an item? There is. Star piece! They sell for quite a lot, actually. 
cool. Let's head up this way. Okay, what do you have to say for yourself? Hey there, I'll give you this. So tell all your friends to come to camp for your town. Oh, wow, well, Ultra Ball, thank you very much. I actually like Ultra Balls as well, because black and yellow, black and yellow. Um, hey there. Oh my god, everyone's just handing items to me. Thank you so much. What's this? Oh. Shabba nor castle. Shabba. Alright, is anyone in here? Anyone important? Oh, Sean is in here. Hi, Rookie. An acquaintance of yours. Two visits to the Shabano. The Shabano? Yeah, Shabano Castle. I can't remember the last time we sent <laughs> two people. Means busy, okay. This castle, sha the chateau, if you will, was a manor house of a noble family. It may be a little run down, but that's because there's a history to this place. During that history, the owners of this castle gave away a lot of their stuff to everyone. That's why it feels so empty. The end. Oh. Uh, th that's it? Don't you have anything related to Mega Revolution? That's it. What, what, what in the world is Mega Revolution? <laughs> hmm. Oh, exclamation marks everywhere. Sir, it's back again. Is it that time of year already? Well, there's nothing I can do about that now. I need to go to Route 7, but please, take your time to have a look around. I will, thanks. Probably not, but yeah. I wonder what that's all about. Why don't you go to Route 7 too? Well, actually, I don't really need you to tell me what to do. Alright, Shauna, you're not my mum. Jeez. Alright, let's head this way. So this is the way to Route 7. Uh, there's also a berry... Th actually, do not screw it, I'll show it off down here, I may as well. Hey there! Hey, hey mister, th this way! Y you! I know this is an unexpected request, but I need you to take care of my berry field. Berries are great, one berry can produce more berries. I assure you that I you'll love the field work. I guess... Oh, great! Uh, oh, your name is Sav. Thank you, Sav. Hooray! That's great, Grandpa! I must teach you how to take care of the field right away. Follow me, please. Sure thing. Plant a berry in this soft soil. Check the, so check the soil uh, you want to plant the berry in and choose a berry from your bag. Oh, I know. I should give you some berries to plant. Orange berries. Woo! Well, I might as well give you those berries too. These berries, sorry. Petri berries too. You'll find a berry in front of a huge tree. Come here and plant it. Once you plant the berry, the next step is watering. Here, this is for you. Sprinkle out hard. Cool. Check the soil where you plant the berry. If, and if it's dry, water it. Take good care and you'll get more berries. Well, Zav, please take care of this field. I'm so relieved. My back has been killing me lately. And I just can't garden like I used to. <laughs> we live in the house on the corner of the field. Cool story. Alright, so I haven't actually done this yet, but we may as well just, yeah. Uh, let's go to... Why am I going to my pack one? I need to go to my bag. Bag, please. Okay, so if we go to our berry bag, we can plant orange berries. Wait, no, you don't go to your bag then, apparently. I suppose we have to do interact with this. Okay, plant a berry. Uh, orange berry. Oh, wow, that's cool. Okay, so... I guess now what we got to do is go to the sprinkler. Spring oh, it's, it's a low tad! Sprink low tad! Oh, that's awesome. Uh, I guess we can't access it from there either, so we have to interact with it again. Yes, water it. Water it. Oh, wow, that's amazing! Yay! Okay, so it's nice and moist. <laughs> Alright, so let's see what's going on over here. Whoa, Snorlax! Oh my god! Rookie, what is it? Pan over to Snorlax. And you can see the daycare in the top left corner. Here we go again. It's sleeping so soundly. The end of the world wouldn't wake it. Look, it's practically a mountain, right? It's blocking the road completely. Come now, sir. Use the poke flute. Oh, wait. Do you even have it anymore? Nope, I handed it over. Or you could say it was taken by the owner of the palace. What? Huh? That, what's a poker flute? Basically, the poker flute is what is needed to wake up a Snorlax, but the poker flute is currently at Path and Palace. Oh, that's it. Then all we need to do is go get it then. Come on, Rookie, let's go. The Path and Palace is just past Route 6. And maybe a place like that, we might learn something good about Mega Evolution. True story. Let's go. So let's head up Route 7. Where a lot of battles and stuff await us. Hey there, bro. Whoa, lag. Hey there. This the pliers lands you uh, blada blue to blada blue. All right, get massive frame. There's a TM over there. I can see a TM. I can see a TM. I want it. Can you see that gold? Oh, God damn it! I'm gonna skip by. See you later. No, I'm joking. I bet you thought I was just some unassuming tourist. I happen to be a seasoned battler too. Oh, let's go. Show me. Oh my God, she's scary. <laughs> Pikachu. Ah, oh, Pikachu, you're so cute. Okay. Oh shit, I've got Infahawk in the lead. That's not cool. Okay, let's see if we can take this Pikachu out in one hit with our 
Leetness. Ooh, close, but no cigar. Pikachu's gonna go for a quick attack. At least he's not using an electric move. We can finish this thing off with Peck now. Actually, I meant to use Ember because I didn't want to make contact, but. Don't stag me. Alright, cool. Alright. Experience! Alright, let's switch into Charmant. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> let's go to Conquer. <laughs> Can't put up a fire type me into water type. That's not gonna work. Not until he evolves anyway, he can be charged on X. Okay, Psyduck. Cloud 9. That's not really gonna affect us. So let's go ahead and use Vine Whip here. And take down this Psyduck. Slapped in the face. Haha! <laughs> Alright. Who's next? 150 experience. And Pidgey. Let's send out Charmander. Let's see if we can get Charmander to, uh, Charmander to evolve here. Because that would be useful. God, leave that on! Pidgey, level 11. We're actually quite close to a uh, leveling up here, but I don't think we're close enough, so... Alright, bam! Ember's not even going to do half. And Tackle's going to do 7. We're good. Let's do another scratch and see if this can finish it off. Ooh, it, they pretty much do like the same amount of damage. And now it's using freaking um, sand attack. Like a dick. But it doesn't really matter. We killed it anyway. Bye, Pidgey. How much experience are we going to get from that? Not enough. So close, though. Congrue level 18, nonetheless. That's always. What, what, what? Yeah, that's right. You know. You know where it is. You know how it is. Alright, let's battle you. Hey, it's another tourist. What, why do I have to travel? Why do I battle? Allow me to demonstrate. I should have said have there, but oh well. Another scary lady. Oh my god, Zigzagoon. Let's go, Zigzagoon. Alright, in for Hawk. Show him how it's done. Let's go with a quick attack, I think. Actually, I should probably use tackle because it's more strong, uh, more stronger, more powerful, or more strong. I don't know. I don't know English. English isn't my first language. Just kidding. I'm from Britain. No, I am. Okay, so next is a Ralts. Oh, Ralts is the coolest, though. On that Gallade, son. Or Mega Gardevoir, either or. Ralts, oh shit. Okay, let's go with a scratch for that physicalness. Still not gonna kill it. Whoa, Ralts is getting serious on us, using confusion and shit. Let's get rid of this. I'm going to try and not use, uh, well, I'd say, well, after the Pokemon I've got now, I'm going to try and use uh, some Pokemon in, level up, yes, uh, in the Kalos region that aren't typically used, maybe. I'm trying to learn Dragon Rage, just an overpowered move for this kind of stage in the game. I mean, I was going to plan, I was planning on getting Hone Edge, but I can imagine a lot of people use Hone Edge in their runs, so. If you guys got any suggestions, actually, you may as well comment them below. There's no harm in doing that. Alright, so I'm level 16 and I have 40 HP, so I'm guessing one Dragon Rage is going to take this Gulpin out without any trouble. <laughs> oh gosh, we've just got the most overpower poke whenever. Okay. And now, it's time for our third evolution. Go, go, Charmander. Do, 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 do. It takes so long! Charmeleon looks like the best though. Oh. Yeah. Charmeleon. Hell yeah. That looks cool. He looks so cool. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Alright. Um, I think he learns Fire Fang somewhere soon. It'd be nice to have a physical fire move. For that stab. Alright. What's down here? Is this going to take us away? Ooh. I guess we'll come back here afterwards, maybe. And I guess if you go down the right side, we can find that TM. So I guess we'll have a bit of an explore after we've sorted out everything from the path from Palace. What do you guys have to say for yourselves? I'd like to live in that kind of palace. Now, in my Y run, this gate was already open when I tried to access it. So it was really weird. It was kind of glitched. I don't know. The entrance fee will be 1,000 poker dollars per person. You've got to be kidding, it costs money to go inside. You see, the owner of the palace follows a school of thought that you can never have too much money. Yes, this is how the rich get richer. Here's your entrance fee. Is that how you give money, Shauna? 
The proceeds of the entrance fee I'll pay for repairing and restoring the palace. Probably. <laughs> Probably. Meaning they use the money for something else, really. I like how there's like superiors on the door, that looks cool. I didn't notice that till now, actually. Alright. That's right, Sean. Just skip ahead of me, that's fine. It just disappears. Can you actually explore this place? No. I don't think you could. Alright, well. Oh, that is very posh. How the doors do swing open like that. And there's a Milo tick. Oh, snap. Oh, where is it? Oh, he's mad. Oh, he's going mental. Where could it be? Look at him. He's just... My fur fru. My beloved little fur fru has disappeared. Hey, it's disappeared? Hey, Rookie, we should help look. I mean, if my if my Pokemon was missing, I'd be sick with worry. Get out of my way then, bitch. My beloved fur fru has disappeared. Okay, so we got to go find this guy's fur fru, fur fru, fur fru. So if we head this way... I'm pretty sure it takes us outside. Whoa, look at this Pokemon statue. That's awesome. Is that an Eevee? I see an Eevee. Okay, exclamation point. I'll have a look in the back. Alright, chicky. Let's go. Are there Pokemon trainers? Whoa, holy crap. Is that Reshiram? That's cool, man. Hey, do you battle? A Furfru flew by. Oh, I need to find him. What in here? Oh, there's a TM over there. TM, please. It's probably pointless, but... Oh, it's cut. We found cut. No, 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 no. Alright. I need to guess I need to get a HM slave at some point. Uh, soup potion. Cool. Alright, let's back. Let's go find this fur through. Hey there. Hey, I see the fur through. Hey, bro. Oh. Oof, oof. Gonna paddle away. What? What a loser. Alright. Okay, so basically, we need to get you. We need to get him to stand him in the dead end, so. Alright, what are we gonna do? Alright, I know how to do this, bruh. Where is he? First, where is he? Right, he's in he wasn't there a second ago. Alright, so basically, we're going to get her to stand in these square positions. You stand there, and I'll come around this way, and he's going to run up. Alright, so now I've got to go back and get her, because she's being a dumb bitch. And Yes, come with me. I need to get her to stand here. Actually, wait, where did he run to? Yeah, he ran into center. So she stands there, so that fur fruit can't run the other way. And then you run this way, and he's just like, oh shit, I'm in the corner. Easy! Phew, well done, we finally caught it. Rookie, you're amazing. Oh, oh, you. Stop it, you. Hey, dude, you found your fur fruit. Oh, my dear fur fruit, my beloved fur fruit. Could you be the two responsible for my wonderful. What? what <laughs> I guess, see what you did there? Wonder fruit. See? <laughs> Reunion with my dear fruit fruit. How wonderful indeed. It's marvellous, simply marvellous. A situation like this demands fireworks. We shall put on a, a fire, a share paper. My Pokemon and I are reunited. Our bond has been proven. We'll commemorate the joyous occasion with a tremendous fireworks display. Alright. Rendezvous. You can reach the balcony from the Hall of Mirrors on the second floor. Alright, so I guess we sp suppose we should head that way. If I were a Pokemon, I'd hate to have a trainer like that. What? Why? Fireworks are the best, bro. I'd love to have a trainer that launched fireworks. Fireworks are my best friends. Right. Alright, let's get through here. And head back into... Which way am I going? Oh, wrong way. I wonder if you can fish here, actually. If you get a rod or something. Alright. And then let's head this way. Uh, the balcony's just above the door, so I guess we got to go there. Uh, can we get to the second floor this way? Where's the stairs? There they are. Okay. I should probably talk to more people, because I'm sure they give you more items and stuff, but... Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to walk through this cool looking hallway right here. And head to the balcony. And Sean, how did you get up here first? You're crazy, man. There's loads of mazes and stuff here. There's probably loads of items and stuff I've missed out on. But I guess I get them in between episodes if I need to. Oh my, how romantic. Um, you know, I've never watched fireworks alone with a boy before. Oh my. Oh my, this is getting a bit out of hand. Dratini, oh my god. Oh my god, epic, romantic, pan, zoom, slide across thing. We haven't even seen them yet, but I know I'll never forget these fireworks, because I watched them with you, Zav. Alright, this is definitely getting out of hand. Woo! 
Fireworks in the day? Who does that? This is pretty cool, though. I mean, you probably can't even see them they're in the day, though. I've never seen anyone fire fireworks in the day. Probably because you can't really see them, but whatever. It would look better if it was, like, in the evening. It is in the evening, though. My, I don't know why my 3DS like, clock's, like, it's, like, half seven. Wow, that was amazing. I never want to forget this, so I'll keep this me keep this memory in an album in my heart. That was soppy as shit. And that was my wander through fireworks show for my fur through. I assume you're satisfied with that. Oh, I almost forgot the poke flute. That's right, we need to f we need the flute to wake up Snorlax. Sigh, the poker flute, huh? Go get it. It was a Shabanu's, uh, Shabanu's castle treasure, but I took it as a payment for a loan. A rich guy like me and a common person like that that just didn't go together. Give it to them. <laughs> God, he's so old of fucking now. Here's the poke flute. Alright, awesome. We got the poke flute so we can make up that freaking Snorlax now. Listen well, you two. Always return what you borrow. That's very important. Pfft. Pfft. I still have mine on my other one. <laughs> you can't imagine how stressful running a place is for him. Or maybe so, but... Oh, that's right. Mr. Butler, do you know anything about Mega Evolution? I remember reading out of a book on a subject in the Palace Library. It had something to do with what you'd now call a trainer holding a mysterious stone higher, making a Pokemon evolve even further. Although it's not much, but I would like you to have this. He gave me Protect. Yay, TM17, the most annoying TM ever. Woo. Protect block. Yeah, we already know what that does, bro. He's a monocle. What an awesome person. Alright, so now that's, that's done, we can actually go wake up the Snorlax. But, I suppose, uh, I'm going to have an explore through here in between episodes. But, for now, I'm going to end this episode off here, guys. So, I hope you've enjoyed. And if you have, then don't forget to leave a rating and stuff. And I will catch you in the next one. So, see you next time, guys.